In order to use your fifth element bar, unroll your lines on the beach. Lay down the bar on the beach and weigh it down with a rock or your board. Then walk down the lines, untangle them. Take the three front lines into your hands as shown to really get them sorted out. You can adjust the leader lines of your bar by simply pulling up the floater, loosen up the knot and sliding it down. You can use the fifth element bar in two different widths. Simply open the lark's head, slide the leader line out, pull on the leader line attachment and tie a new lark's head in order to secure your leader line again. Then pull down the floater to cover the knots. In order to depower your kite, you simply pull on the line loop to depower it. To power it up again, pull on it and release the line. The fifth element bar has the option to change the depower stroke. You can simply pull on the back of the vario cleat to lengthen the depower line and therefore lengthen your depower stroke. The new sliding stopper can be slided down by just pulling on the ball and get slid up again by just pushing it up. In a safety moment, you can simply push against the sliding stopper and will be able to push it away from you to get more depower. To reassemble the iron hut, simply push the red slider up and let go. The reinforced Y connection is a new feature on the new fifth element bar. In order to have your bar set up perfectly, leader lines and the flying lines need to be equal length. For attaching the safety leash, simply feed the pin through the line loop and pull the slider back to feed the pin in. For releasing, push the red slider away from you. Available from powercatshop.com.